name is Mercedes and I'm a double major in English and Women and Gender Studies and I want to be a part of this project because I think that education is a huge part in making people aware of sexual assault issues and also helping prevent these issues. Um, I definitely think that there are um, some myths about misinformation regarding sexual assault on this campus and I think that really stems from maybe a lack of understanding of the issue and also somewhat of a lack of education. Um, violence prevention educators and the sexual assault prevention programs have really um, just started implementing some programs to help make students aware of what's going on but people still have this idea in their head that um, people um, accusing somebody of sexual assault is just them regretting bad sex and I think that stems from a culture of rape where we think it's okay to victim blame. Um, what we know is that it's never okay to victim blame and that um, it's actually a very small percentage of people who um, false report. It's the same as any um, violent crime according to FBI statistics and so people aren't, aren't f false reporting and we really need to support victims. Um, for somebody who hears misinformation about violence and wants to speak up but may feel uncomfortable, I think the best thing to do is um, to kind of direct it towards yourself instead of trying to say, well this is what I learned, say, hey um, I don't appreciate what you're saying, um, it sounds like you're trying to blame the victim or um, what you're saying kind of goes against my values. I think this kind of goes back to that um, Minnesota North Dakota nice. People don't want to offend you so if you make it it seem like you're offending me by saying this, this is the correct information, I think people are receptive to that. I also think that peer education is a really effective way to change people's minds about things. Um, so when you hear your peers say, mm, I don't think that's right, um, I think this is the actual statistics, I feel like students are more likely to say, oh, okay, I must have misheard something or um, maybe I need to look into this issue further. Um, I think this poster campaign is really great and I think the biggest thing that I want other NDSU students to take away from this is that um, victims and survivors are supported here on campus, um, that we know that false reports are um, a very small percentage of the reports that do occur and that most people don't even report sexual assault because it's kind of a hidden, um, a hidden act. And so I want victims and survivors to know they're supported and I want NDSU students to be aware of this issue and um, think of it as a concern, something that they should be aware of um, because there's more survivors and victims out there than we even know about.